So in this video, I want to show you that there's a tool in Bing where you can look at your location across the world and thus see, like, you know, do I rank in a particular city or a particular zip code? All right, so here's how. So first and foremost, you, of course, have to have a Bing account, and I've got a link uh, to the Bing Advertising Center there. So you have to create an account if you don't have one. It only works if you have an account. And then you want to go into your sub-account if you have more than one. I mean, I have more than one because I'm an agency. You might just have one. Then you want to go to the Tools menu. So if you're in your account, go to the Tools menu. Then go to uh, Add Preview and Diagnostics Tool. That's this guy here. Now, if you're logged into your account, I also have a link. You can just click right over on the link. Then you're going to click in here and you're going to do your search. So let's take veterinarian right near me or something. And then you're going to change your location. So we'll put in here New York City. So you have to kind of New York and then hit enter. Otherwise, it doesn't know where you are. And you have to find it on the list. It's not as smart as Google. And then click mobile device. It doesn't work for the desktop. So click mobile device and then hit preview. Now, it's not a very beautiful preview. I mean, come on, people. We're working with Bing here. Uh, but it does show you the ads that are showing, and then in the in the local bar here, it's going to show you like what you'd see, and then the listings here, uh, so you can see the local listings in New York City, right? Now, so you can go up here and you can change this, right? You can change this, and you can change your location, you know, to whatever. Let's change it to Boston. So you can go in here and you can put in Boston, and hit enter and find Boston, Massachusetts and then hit preview. So now we're looking at the ads that we'd see if we were in Boston, and we're gonna scroll down here, and again, not a very beautiful format, but you can see you know, what shows in the so-called local pack, and then what, what happens, what do you see uh, down in here. Now, it's not perfect, it isn't a very perfect tool, but it does give you some way to see what you would see on Bing in different locations across the internet. Now. Uh, just to wrap that up, another thing to do, which, you know, is again, quick and dirty, is just go to Bing and just type in, you know, your search, especially if it's city-focused, veterinarian, why did I choose the hardest word to spell? So you can also just use your geo terms, and that will also kind of override your particular location, and then you can see what you see there as well. Uh, this isn't as good as the other method, but it's another method to see, like, what do people see? Uh, across the internet on Bing versus location. So hope you enjoyed it. This is just a quick video. Uh, shout out to the folks at Bing. Keep working. We wish you were more competitive to Google, uh, but this is a way to use the Google slash, I'm sorry, <laughs> to use the Bing ad preview and diagnostic tool to look at ads and geolocations on the Bing platform. Thank you for watching.